Hey y'all, it's Miss P and I am back for our second week of music. This week, we are going to learn about pitch and melody. Pitch is a high or low sound. Today, we are going to talk about three pitches, sol, mi, and do. When we sing sol, the highest note, we will put our hands on our head. When we sing mi, the middle note, we will put our hands on our shoulder. When we sing do, the lowest note, we will put our hands on our lap. It would look and sound like this. So mi, do, you, try, ready, go. Very good. Now, Miss P is going to sing and sign different patterns of pitches. You listen first and sing and move second. Be sure to show me where the pitch goes. Is it so on your head, me on your shoulder, or do in your lap? Make sure that you are singing and moving your hands to your head for so, shoulders for me, and your lap for do. I go first, then you sing and move like me. So me, so, so me. Good job. Here's number two. So me, do, do. Here's number three. Do, me, so, me. Number four. Do, me, do, me, so. Five. So, so, me, me, do, do, do. Excellent work. When we just sang those different patterns of pitches, we sang a melody. A melody is a group of high and low notes played one after the other, just like do, mi, so, so, do. That was a pattern of the three pitches do, mi, and so, played one after the other. We are now going to learn the melody that goes with today's musical story. The main character of our book is named Marvelous Cornelius, and he was a famous garbage collector in the French Quarter of New Orleans. He was known for singing and dancing and performing on his route. People couldn't wait for garbage day so they could see him and he would cheer them up. Whenever you hear me sing, who was he? You will sing this. Marvelous Cornelius from New Orleans His streets were bright and shiny Kept of sparkling feet Now that you've heard the melody, let's learn it by the three pitch names we learned earlier. So, Mi, Do. I go first, you go next. Remember to make sure you're singing and moving your hands like Miss P. Here's the first part. So, so, me, me, so, so, me. Your turn, ready, go. My turn, here I go. Do, do, do. Your turn, ready, go. My turn, here I go. Do, do, me, so, me. Your Turn, ready, go. My turn, here I go. So, so, me, me, do, do, do. Your turn, ready, go. Excellent work. This time, I'm going to sing the whole first line of the melody, and then you will copy me. Here I go. So, so, me, me, so, so, me, do, do, do. 
Your turn. Ready, go. Great work. Here's line two. Do, do, mi, so, mi, so, so, mi, mi, do, do, do. Your turn. Ready and Wonderful job, y'all. Now, let's put the lyrics back in the song while still moving our hands to our head, shoulder, and lap to remind us when to sing which pitch. Marvelous Cornelius from New Orleans. His streets were bright and shiny, kept them sparkling clean. One more time, sing with me. Marvelous Cornelius from New Orleans. His streets were bright and shiny, kept them sparkling clean. Excellent singing voices, ladies and gentlemen. Ready for a challenge? You are going to think the melody in your head, so sing it to yourself. And you're going to show me where the pitches go during the song by placing your hands on your head, shoulders, or lap. Miss P will play the piano part. You sing in your head and move your hands. Here we go. Hands start and sew on your head. One, two, move and think. <laughs> to compose your own melody using the three pitches from today, so, me, and do. So you will go to our virtual classroom and click on the red email button and there's where you will put the recording of you singing your melody. You can go back to the beginning of this video to get some ideas to compose your very own. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Before we go to our musical story of the week, I want to review our music vocab words. The beat is the steady pulse. Rhythm is a pattern of long and short sounds. A composer is a person who writes music. Form is the order of a song. Pitch is a high or low sound. Melody is a group of high and low notes or sounds played one right after the other. We have learned so much in our first two lessons and I am so proud of you and cannot wait to hear your melodies. Without further ado, it is time for Marvelous Cornelius Hurricane Katrina and the Spirit of New Orleans. Marvelous Cornelius, Hurricane Katrina and the Spirit of New Orleans by Phil Bildner, illustrated by John Para, and music by Miss P. In the quarter, there worked a man known in New Orleans as Marvelous Cornelius. Who was he? Marvelous Cornelius from New Orleans. His streets were bright and shiny, kept them sparkling clean. Morning, he saluted the silver-haired man with the Times Picayune tucked under his arm. Greetings, he waved to the couple with the baby on the balcony. Ma'am, he nodded to the woman shaking rugs out at her front window. And when his truck rounded the turn, my youngins, he called to the kids crowding the corner. Marvelous Cornelius, they cheered. Marvelous Cornelius. Who was he? Marvelous Cornelius from New Orleans. His streets were bright and shiny, kept them sparkling clean. And 
and at each home, Cornelius sashayed to the curb and shimmied to the hopper, unloading the garbage. Not a single prowling rapper ever stayed on the streets. And those spotless streets, oh, how they sparkled. Now sing after me. Woo, woo, woo. He called to his driver when it was time to stop. Rat-a-tat-tat. He strummed to the side when it was time to move. Cornelius front flipped to the curb and flung the bags over his head, behind his back, between his legs, into the truck. He lined the bags along the curb and then he launched them. Bag after bag after bag after bag after bag after bag. perfect pyramid inside the hopper's metal mouth. Bang! He clapped the covers like cymbals and he twirled the tins like tops. Whizzing and spinning back and forth across the street. And just like those twisting tops, Cornelius danced too. Tangoing up Toulouse, sambaing down St. Peter, rumbaing up Royal, cha cha down Charters, and everyone danced along. The old ladies whistled and whirled, the old men hooted and hollered, the barbers, beat twirlers, and beignet bakers bounded behind the one-man parade. But then one day the storm came. The great city filled with water. People and the mountain of ruins, some as high as the steeple atop St. Louis Cathedral. It would take thousands of me to clean this, he wept. His spirit and will were waterproof. Who was he? Marvelous Cornelius from New Orleans. His streets were bright and shiny, kept them sparkling clean. And just like he did every morning, he emptied the garbage into his hopper. And the kids who crowded the corner, they pitched in too. So did the silver-haired man, the couple from the balcony, the 
woman with the rugs, the old ladies and old men, the barbers, bee twirlers, and beignet bakers. Others, too, from Brooklyn and Boise, Baltimore and Bakersfield, Syracuse, Seattle, Santa Fe, San Antonio. They stream to the Crescent City. Thousands, millions, a flood of humanity. Now sing after me. Marvelous Cornelius, he passed on. But as for his spirit, that's part of New Orleans. New Orleans forever.